Hello and welcome to my first Lizard Men campaign battle video and we're going to be facing off against an army of the New World Colonists led by Philip Billings he's got a load of swordsmen and a couple of crossbowmen some free company militia some spearmen and a small garrison for the settlement and um, we've got uh, an army we sort of very quickly cobbled together to kind of blitz these early factions we've got some sort of spears, some sort of warriors some skink cohort and some javelins and an artillery piece. We've also got some temple guard which Mazda Mundi starts with. So yeah we're on about turn 5 and we managed to blitz Skeggy really quickly and now I want to take out these guys as well so we can secure our starting position. And this is the first real sort of 50-50 battle we've had in the campaign so I thought this would be the first one we'd record. So let's jump in. Okay, uh, we might as well gamble. So I haven't really fought much in Lustra since getting Warhammer 2. I've um, done a Dark Off campaign and a High Off campaign. So I've mostly been fighting around Nagarond and Off 1. So it's going to be fun to uh, get stuck into some of these jungle maps, which I haven't really seen too much of yet. Okay, so this could be a little tricky. So it's going to be a whole load of forest between us. It's going to be a forest engagement, which might be difficult to see. We might be able to lure them out of the forest. We have an artillery unit here, a uh, Bastilodon. So we'll probably try and use that to lure them through. And we've got some skink cohort over here. We'll stick that over at the side. And then we've got these javelin guys. We'll put those over on the side. Temple guard, we'll put it just at the back. Actually, we might put these guys at the front. I'm probably going to end up spanning a lot of these units and getting the upgraded versions with shields as soon as I can. Um, we'll put some spears over there with these guys. Uh, what have we got over here? We've got some more spears. Yeah, I'm not sure if they've got any cavalry, so... I'll yeah, we'll just use these guys as a meat shield. As I said, we're going to expand a lot of these units and get the better quality ones as soon as we can. So I'm not too worried about casualties here. Okay, I don't think we can see too much yet. We can just see a unit. It looks like they might gonna they're probably gonna fall back to this hill, so we're gonna We're gonna push up here real quick. I really love the Lizard Men. I sort of held off on the Lizard Men campaign. But these guys look amazing. And the skinks are a lot of fun. Probably won't see too many of them as the campaign progresses. We'll stick mostly to Saurus warriors and Crux cigars and stuff like that. Okay, so we can't see... T okay, there's a couple of units there. I wonder if we can... We'll try and get some shots in when we can on those. Uh, let's grab everyone else. to about there because our artillery should force them to advance on us but I'm not sure if we're going to get a, any kind of clean shot on these guys because of the trees there beam of Chotek causes terror that's pretty sweet Okay, they exist and they've got some archers there. And what do we have as well as money? We've got a charm spell, that's an item ability. We've got this net, we've got regeneration. Okay, let's get everyone pushed up. We're just going to have to rush these guys. Let's send in some spearmen, let's pull that back. I'm going to lock those guys down as we advance. 
There we go. So this is a forest battle, so it's going to be tricky to see what the hell is going on, even with the uh, foliage turned off. So we're going to push up all of our skinks first, and we're going to get Mesdomundi in combat too, because he's pretty powerful in melee, even though he's a spellcaster. Let's bring these guys around this side. I'm just going to pretty much try and overwhelm these guys. But yeah, it's going to be tricky to see what's going on in this fight. I'm not sure we can uh, turn any of these more in there. We can't turn the trees off themselves. It's a shame. So we're just gonna we're just gonna try and completely surround them. And this is all the first time that we have blood enabled. Because they updated that with the Mortal Empires patch. So the first time I've got to see the blood effects in the game. Look at that skin, he's having a great time just jumping in there. Uh, I'll probably bring this around the side as well. And we'll target some of these guys at the back. Well, that was a nice hit. Uh, where's our temple guard? Okay, they're on this flank. Yeah, we're just going to push all of these guys around. So let's get our javelins firing in. Let's get our Soros warriors running in. There's their lord. And uh, let's boost up some of these guys as well. Then a regeneration. I'm going to tie these guys down as well with a nice net. Oh, this is money just exploding people. He doesn't care. Okay, we see that net coming down, trapping all of these units. So they're not going to be going anywhere. getting around the sides here. Uh, let's try and boost up some of their health. I'll give them the cold blood regeneration. I don't think we need it at the moment. It's turned into a bit of a grind fight in that central area there. I'd love to have a wind spell. I guess chase these guys off. Take everyone off guard mode. Now I think they're meant to have fixed that bug where some units just stopped responding if they're on guard mode. We really need to start getting around behind them, but these guys are going to be a problem if we do. If we can break this right flank, we can just fold in, take everyone out. Push Master Monday, you're right through this nice here. Now Master Monday, in you go. <laughs> oh, that's wonderful. And then they all just explode. There we go. Slowly getting broken. Starting to envelop these guys now, pushing through. Their lord's morale is almost broken. Breaking that unit, that's good. Let's bring these guys over. 
Looks like their lord is almost dead. Give him some more damage resistance. Okay, they're broken. They're starting to break. These guys aren't quite broken yet. They are now. That's good. Okay, it's completely enveloped them. Okay, we've seen off those guys. We've seen off those guys. This is looking good. Still got some guys over here. So it's okay, it looks like it's going to be a chain route. That unit's gone berserk, that's okay, don't need to worry too much about that. Let's try and take this general out if we can. That's the Monday. Really laying it down. Racking up the kills. Okay, that should be pretty much it. They're routing, they're all routing, that's good. They're going, the Lord is down. I think these guys are still in the action, they're on skirmish, so but it looks like they've gone. Yep, that's it. You're a bit messy when you're fighting in jungles like this. I'm hoping we're not gonna have too many maps which are gonna be like this. Yeah, I'll probably be disbanding a lot of these units as I said earlier on, uh, replacing them with the tier two versions. Just kind of blitzing through these early stages. Those poor, poor humans. No, nah, we don't feel bad. Shouldn't have come to our jungles. I was actually in pretty good relations with these guys diplomatically, but I wanted their territory. This guy's still hanging in there. He's really going at it. No, it looks like he's had enough. enough. And that guy is down. It's pretty messy in there. Go and stab him. I'm not sure this lizardman knows what's going on. <laughs> this guy's just wailing on him and he's just he's, he's looking he's too busy looking over there. Ah uh, whatever. Okay, let's end that there. Let's take a look at the battle stats. Yeah, these guys do really, really strong guys. 139, 134, 148, 110, 209, 108 for those Temple Guard. I bet he took any damage. Really impressive though. I mean, I've seen some other Lizardman videos that other people have done, and yeah, they, they tend to get a lot of kills, these guys. These are only Tier 1 versions. Okay, that's it for this campaign battle. Um, so this is the first one. It's about, like I said, Turn 5, I think. So, um, a very early game. Just blitzing through these early stages. Um, but we'll have a lot more Lizardman videos coming up soon. So I'll see you then.